Okay, kid, you're next. Right. That's how I turn. Oh my god, this turning is horrible. So ugly on, ass. Get your ass up there. Damn, I'm a kid, chill. <laughs> Mr. Bunny Man. Don't hurt me, Mr. Bunny Man. Say cheese. Cheese. I didn't press on that. That was, that was really embarrassing, but yeah. <laughs> oh, motherfucker. Run. Okay. Why are you screaming at it? Why are you screaming at it? Yeah, this is not scary at all. Ooh, motherfucker. Run! Okay. Oh, wait, no, wrong way! I heard the door. I heard the door. I heard the door. That scared me. I heard. <laughs> I'll take care of him. You'll be safe here. I locked the door. But you was not taking care of him. That broom ain't gonna do nothing. <laughs> oh, he's gonna kill me. Alright, I'm gonna find a way out while you get killed. Oh! Okay, I need Boring! Oh, fuck! Gotcha, bitch! There, right here. Let me go through. Why are you fucking? Oh my god, I wasted my time there for nothing. Anthony Smith, more commonly known as the Easter Ripper. The mere mention of his name sends shivers up the spines of parents across the country. His horrible murder spree leaving lives shattered and families ripped apart. Hi. Tonight, we'll go inside his vacant home, oh, where 11 innocent children spent their final moments in agonizing pain and terror. 11? Damn! <laughs> Untouched since those horrible crimes eight years ago, some say his spirit still haunts the home till this day. I'm Dana Turner, and this is a News 9 special report. Silenced Tears inside the home of serial killer Anthony Smith. God, we're putting people to sleep here with this boring story. Time to sex this up. Hey, oh, you. Yeah. Me? Yeah, you. Put this shoot on. Harry, what the fuck are you doing here? No one's gonna want to watch this boring thing. And your dry reporting isn't helping. I'm reading the teleprompter. Bitch. People want to see ghosts! Okay, intern, when Dana says he still haunts the home he grew up in, I want you to run through the background. Got it? Alright, let's do this. Oh. Action! The rampage started in a job meant to spread joy and cheer put him in the perfect position to abduct young children until his capture and execution in 1985. Many of the bodies have not been recovered. As told by the sole survivor, Randy Martinez, Smith would release the children in his greenhouse and force them to go on a deadly Easter egg hunt while he stalked and murdered them. Two years later, many say he still haunts the home he grew up in. <laughs> what was that? Tom, did you get that? I apologize to the viewers at home, but I just felt an energy pass by behind me. Let's oh my god, that was so ass. Secrets we uncover. What? That was so ass. This is rating school. Let's take a break and pick up in the bedroom. Damn, this smell like rating bronze. What the what are you talking about, bro? <laughs> Great timing. I'm going to go use the restroom. Hey you, I'm getting hungry. Take the van and go pick us up some pieces. Use the station credit card. Ew, yeah, crowbar. Hell yeah, I take the crowbar. Let's make that bitch in the head with it. Oh, pow. And that man's good. Hi, how are oh, you? bitch! The fuck? Ain't supposed to be dead? Fucking dumbass. Can't kill properly, huh? Is it laughing or a duck? When you do, when you, when you do 
stupid shit, you get stupid shit. The fuck? Damn! 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 Fucking door. Get in, get the fucking. Uh, apparently, I can't be. <laughs>